Hello everyone. We hope you're having an amazing day today. We know that many of you were waiting eagerly for this particular weekend, as it marks the Christmas week off. It's great to spend the cold days of winter as holidays since we love to cuddle under a blanket with our hot beverages. But one thing that's missing is the presence of a brand new episode of Yellowstone. Still, Yellowstone Universe continues to bless us with other shows such as 1923. 1923 just started to be released a couple of weeks ago, and one episode were not enough for us to get into the show. So when it's announced that Yellowstone will have its new episodes on January 1, 2023, we were worried that same thing will happen to 1923 as well. Thankfully, 1923 continued as scheduled and we got to watch the series' second episode this week. The issue is that many of us are still struggling in tuning into 1923 as many people were oblivious to the fact that the show was about to be released. When it comes to Yellowstone, it's almost like a reflex at this point as we are all familiar with the show and feel like it's our duty to sit in front of the TV on Sunday nights. But 1923 is a new one and we are still yet to understand how to watch it, when to watch it, and where to watch it. So before the series continues with its third episode next weekend and continues to bless us every single weekend for the upcoming two months, we believe it's our duty to enlighten you guys on the issue. But first, let's remember what 1923 is about. 1923 is a follow-up series to the hit Yellowstone Universe show, 1883. In 1883, we followed how Duttons moved from Tennessee to Montana and how they settled there. It was a tragic series, of course, as traveling was a deadly business in the 19th century. Still, we believe Taylor Sheridan, the creator of the series, made a good job in providing us with a glimpse of the era while shedding a light on the Duttons family heritage. Now, in 1923, we follow the events of 40 years in the future, when the Duttons have already settled in Montana and become well-known ranchers in the region. Naturally, things are not very smooth as there are natural disasters and lots of disagreements among ranchers that make it difficult to survive in the region. Still, it seems like the Duttons know what they are doing, and they are pretty good at doing it. The show has a very strong cast, which makes it even more interesting to watch. Especially the presence of Harrison Ford and Helen Mirren makes the show a must-watch for all of us Yellowstone fans. It seems like both Ford and Mirren are very much happy to be a part of the project as they both admire Sheridan's work very much. The writing and the ambition of the piece that's evident from the scope and scale of it drew me to the role, Ford said in a recent interview and continued. He's an incredible horseman. He's a genuine athlete, and that's something you might not expect to find in such a talented writer and intellectual thinker. Mirren also praised Sheridan's work with the following words, and the precision of his language and dialogue and the character. To be a part of something that's so exciting within the American sort of entertainment world, but also to be a part of something that is investigating American history in this particular way is great. You can't do it in two hours, you know, it's great to have that great sprawl, and I just thought earlier on, it's like a big Russian novel. It's like war and peace, you know, that real sense of an enormous arc of history. And to be a character within that, it's very exciting. Apart from Mirren and Ford, the cast of 1923 includes Sebastian Roche as Father Renaud, Darren Mann as Jack Dutton, Michelle Randolph as Elizabeth Strafford, James Badgedale as John Dutton Sr., and Marley Shelton as Emma Dutton. Now, how can we watch 1923? The answer is pretty easy. 1923 is available on Paramount Plus TV channel. There is only one problem. The channel is on cable TV, meaning that you have to pay some money to access the series. If you buy the essential plan, you have to pay $5 each month. If you buy the premium plan, which doesn't have any ads, you have to pay $10 each month. The good news is currently there is a 50% off campaign going on, meaning that it's cheaper than ever to watch 1923. Another good news is there is a 7-day free trial, which is a blessing especially if you're not sure whether 1923 is your gem or not. If you are outside of the US, you can always use VPN to access American channels. What are your thoughts on 1923? Do you think the show has the potential to be a new favorite Yellowstone Universe series? Do you think it will be better than 1883? Let us know what you think in the comments below and don't forget to like, subscribe, and share the video. Thank you for watching. See you soon.